It was here just within this past month that we had got this breaking information that Google had achieved this quantum supremacy. A lot of people seeing and hearing this information and just kind of like, what? Now, what does this mean? Others saying, okay, let's wait and hear some official information. But the problem is, is if you're one of those just waiting for the official word all the time, you're going to miss the bus on a lot of this stuff that comes and goes because this is proving to be one of those things that indeed was a legitimate leak that came out because Google now officially confirming that they have achieved quantum supremacy. That's right. This is what they're saying now. They're admitting this for those that needed the official word. Okay? And it just... A lot of times when I hear that official thing, I imagine people sitting in front of their TV in the living room just waiting for that to tell them something. Like, that is their God. Like, you can only take in information and believe what Anderson Cooper and them goons tell you off of your TV. All those CIA-trained goons. You know, hopefully, you know, when the person awakens and they realize that, uh, well, maybe there's something more going on here, that's when they unplug and start to seek out the truth in mass. Now, you can't just let huge information come right in front of you and just blow it off. I mean, beyond this story. This story, though, shows that big information can come out before the official word almost a month in advance. And now the company's saying that their 54 qubit Sycamore processor was able to perform a calculation in 200 seconds, which would have taken the world's most powerful supercomputer 10,000 years. That is what Google just admitted that they can do and where they sit in terms of holding the power with this quantum supremacy. We'll break this down further in the next live stream. Make sure to join us every Friday night for Underground World News Live, 9 p.m. Eastern, Dabu77 on YouTube. And hit that subscribe button as well to make sure you're getting notifications for when I'm going live and popping off videos. I'll leave a link below. You can also find breaking news that I'm kicking out over on Twitter as well. Much love, y'all.